In this lecture, I'm going to give you a set of instructions to use as you go through the course to make sure that it works for you and to make sure that you get the most value out of this course. Because this course has to do with changing habits, it's a little different than a skills-based technical course that shows you how to do things at a certain place or a certain time. These things need to be used almost all the time. It needs to be part of your daily routine. So going through this course once and expecting it to work isn't really realistic because you need to internalize it. So I'm going to give you four special instructions that will make it easy to internalize the course and make it easy to start applying to your life right away. Number one, make this course your own. I strongly suggest you take notes on every lecture in this course in your own words so you have a blueprint to work from that's in your own language. And then take those notes, those condensed notes that you just take that you just took from the course and condense them further down to a one page summary of things that might be hardest for you to start using right away. And then put that one page summary somewhere that you'll see every day. Put it on your refrigerator, put it in your bedroom or put it in a notebook that you open every day. And in that way, when you review those things that are hard for you to remember every day, the course will start to become more a part of you. It will start to become part of your everyday life and you'll internalize it faster. Number two, don't fall into a false sense of success early on with this material. It's easy to start having to some successes early on. The motivation, the initial motivation that you get from watching the program will make it easy to apply this material. And in the next few days, you'll probably see some progress. But then after that, once that initial motivation wears out, you might see some fallback into your old habits. Uh, you might see some laziness seep into your life in one way or another. And many of my students have gotten disappointed and stopped using the, pro the program right after seeing this type of disappointment. When this happens to you, all you have to do is read the material, the notes that you took before, the one page summary, recommit yourself to the program, and it will be easier the second time because you already have that experience from the first time you committed to the program. Number three, don't force yourself to implement all these new habits at once. This program is about adding one thing at a time to your life so that it builds up and slowly you internalize one after another. You don't try to take on everything at once because that usually doesn't work. When you force yourself to do something, as you'll learn in a later lecture, it doesn't, it usually backfires. So make sure that you aren't doing that. This program is more about living a more fulfilling life. It's not about building up a bunch of productive habits that allow you to get more done faster just for the sake of getting more done. It's about living a more balanced, satisfying life, in my view, anyway. Balance is important, and that's going to be one of the cornerstones as we go through this course. Number four. If you have any questions, please remember that I'm here to help. I'll be here answering questions in the discussions. This site makes it really easy for me to reply. So please don't hesitate to post a discussion question if you need to. It helps everybody when you post a discussion question. And it gives me better ideas for more lectures I can add to the course later on. And also please remember, if you love what's in this course, please remember to leave a rating and a review of the course to encourage other students to join up. And that's it for now. Look forward to seeing you in the next lecture.